Oh, my goodness. Look where we are. No question. Dad, what are you doing? Nothing. What? This is supposed to be at the Georgetown Express. Mel, you have to see more than one college on a college road trip. What's the harm? The harm is we have a lot of ground to cover, and I've already seen Northwestern. Not as a potential student. But come on, flow with me. Flow with me, Mel. Flow with me. <laughs> look at this place. Oh, look at the trees, the fields. It's like a four-star resort with, with, with some books and learning. Dad, just don't embarrass me, OK? Go, Chad. Number one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Unbelievable. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, Mel. Yes, baby. Number one. Mel. And that's how, in 1853, the university named the surrounding town Evanston in honor of its founder, John Evans. He was a doctor and a builder and boring, boring, boring. Questions? Oh, oh. Uh, mm. Are you sure? Yes. Please, please, please. Go ahead. Hi. Doug Greenhut, BPT, booster parent in training. <laughs> <laughs> We're up here from Orlando on our big college road trip. <laughs> oh, this is Wendy, my daughter. Hi, I'm Wendy Greenhut, CST, <laughs> college student in training. <laughs> You have a question, Tinkerbell? Oh, I, I was just wondering, when is Parents Weekend? Early November. What? That's three months after school starts. Any other riveting questions? <clears throat> yes. Mr. School Spirit, with a foam finger. Disregard his sarcastic tone, James. <laughs> How does Northwestern compare to other universities like Georgetown, for example? Georgetown? Ha! <laughs> We're better than Georgetown. Excuse me. Hypothetically speaking, if your dad was an overprotective control freak and lived 40 miles away from Northwestern, then would you go to Georgetown? Yeah. 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 Who said that? Who said it? I knew this was a bad idea. <laughs>